Decided to come home then? I sort of just ended up here. Big night out then, was it? Nah, I couldn't sleep. I was sat outside for ages. Yeah, right. Geez, sus suspicious or what? What have you done? Nothing. Fine. I was at my mate's last night and I'd had a drink. And then I drove home. I think I might hit someone. You didn't see anyone. You don't even know if it's the same road. I think it was Moira, Dad. Did she see you? I don't know. Think! I, d I don't know. I've no idea, all right? It was dark. What if it's really bad? Where's the car now? I took it to the garage. Kane's garage? Well, I didn't think it was Moira then, did I? Where are the spare keys? <clears throat> no, I can move it. You think I'd let you back behind the wheel? Do you know how close I was to getting sacked last time? Kane's gonna hit the roof. I didn't do it. Put the car back and I'll keep my mouth shut. Well, I'll have a job since I don't know where it is. So what, are you and Charlie just doing it on your own now? Have you got a new place for it? No, cos we've quit. Moira was in hospital all last night. Moira? Why? Car accident. Is it bad? A few cuts and bruises, but she'll be all right. But the point is, Kane's ready to batter someone. Oh, I'll batter you in a minute. Where is the car, Ross? <laughs> if I had nicked your little car, would I be slobbing round here? Don't you think I'd be a little bit busy? So what are you saying? It's actually been nicked? Yeah, it's actually been nicked. Well, what happened to crash in with a mate? Oh, I tried Callum, but he's got this new girl on the go. So you met up with your dad? No, we haven't really had a chance to talk. You, um... heard anything about Moira? Mm, she came out this morning. She did? Paddy's covering surgery, so I'm gonna pop in, see how she's doing. Y well, say hi from me. Well, come with me. Say it yourself. No, she... she won't want to see me. What, a handsome well-wisher like you? She'll perk right up when you walk in. Come in. Hiya. Hey. Make sure she rests, will you? She won't listen to me. Mm. Do you want brew? Oh, yeah, please. She does, won't you? There's no calories in these, cos you've been in the wars. Oh, you're spoiling me. Thank you. Oh, thank you. They're lovely. That's all right. So, you've talked, then? Thanks to a shove from you... What's...? Uh, Moira told me to get over myself about our row. Well, oh, I definitely owe you the flowers, then. Hmm. Anyway, forget about that. Tell us what happened. There's nothing to tell. I just remember a car coming towards me and... Well, that's about it. Oh, that's awful. Mm. I woke up and... Well, I didn't have a clue where I was. Mm. Well, yeah, then I couldn't reach my phone. <coughs> so, uh, how did you get out of there? Oh, there was this old guy. I can't even remember his name, but he must have seen my lights on and stopped. You know, I might still be there if it wasn't for him. Well, good on him. Any word on the driver? No. But the police are tracing the paint on the car. They reckon they'll be able to find out the make and model. Well, that's something. No, it's a long shot. Well, I hope they catch them. Oh, he's been so worried about you. Really? Yeah. I was actually on the Hotton Road not long before you, so could have easily been me. And my mum. Cheers, man. I lost my mum in a car accident, so... Oh, I'm sorry. It's hard, I know. That's how my first husband died. And I was in the car with him. Look, I'm going to try the station again, see if they're any the wiser. OK, thanks. Tell you what, please pray they find him before I do.